Hey, what's going on, everyone? Aunt Pruitt here. I hope you're doing well. I'm unbelievable as always. It's time for another smartphone photographer's video highlight. I want to take a look back at our hangout on there from last week where we discussed um, through the looking glass. But this particular shot that I want to highlight, we had a fairly interesting discussion, if you will. I'm not going to say any more. Just, just check out this clip to the winner and holy crap this is a freaking cool photo <laughs> yes no and then there's something he could have I, I, there, there's something that bugs me about this shot uh, all, right, all right well for let's go it? go ahead for this go ahead just 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 tear it up why don't you get your hand out of there for christ's sake use the auto snap it's such a cool photo, and then his hand the is in the hand, middle of the I think the, the hand, hand makes the shot. Dude. I know I don't like the hand at all. The hand distracts distracts for me. I, I like the extra reflection of it. Gosh, but if yeah. if you okay, look, hear me out. If you remove the hand from it, you have a much cleaner, all the way around shot. It's a picture. It's a picture of a picture taking. It's a picture of a smartphone taking a picture, which is. Freaking awesome. That is cool, but that is just, that's something else Apple would have done. That would have been too clean. You know? It would, no, no, it wouldn't be clean because the lines in the reflective area break up the shot incredibly well. I mean, that hand throws, that the hand's what made it. I think I, the hand just, is what I makes don't like that, the hand. Dude. I, I think like Well, it. you've been outvoted two to one. Oh, yeah. and the Apple, <laughs> I don't like the hand. <laughs> but other than that, this is a freaking cool shot. Yeah. I I it was I when I saw that I said, Oh, that is cool. And I like but I do like the hands the reflection of the hands everywhere. Because if you look at there's a hand on the top and the bottom, the set right side, left side, and yeah. there, uh, there are two hundred hands, two hundred this. It would if you would left just a phone by itself it'd been blah. I think had it been just a phone on its own, it would have been just a clever product placement shot. Right. But I think adding the hand into it gives it a little more character and and almost a little more life as in saying, give me this phone. You know, I want this phone. Let me grab it. Now, if Timmy, Tim, Tim had taught, Nagusko had taken this shot, what he would have done mm -hmm. is he would have put the phone exactly where it's at. Yeah. Taking his hand out, used the auto exposure, and had a little Lego guy pointing out. And had a Lego, yeah. A little that Lego guy. No, that would have worked. Right. <laughs> Again, no, that, that would have worked. worked. But and that's see, adding. But, but see, see, Portis, you just proving my point. He's adding another element to element it, to where to it's it. not just the phone. Right. Because right. if it's if it's just a phone, it'd been. Oh, I could okay. see. I could see. A phone. I could see that, but it would have also added without with. The... Okay, so there you have it. Now, what are your thoughts on Stephen Dainty's photo? The shot looks amazing. Taken with an iPhone, he, he had a very nice setup and a very creative idea to produce that shot. Does he leave his hand showing in the photo? Does he take his hand out of the photo? What are your thoughts? Leave a comment below to let us know how you feel about Stephen's shot and if he could have done anything different to, even, to make that shot even better. Let me know. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to click that like button and that subscribe button so you can get this content automatically. Uh, we have several different playlists here on the channel. Be sure to check out breakingmodern.com and my eyewitness column, which features more beautiful smartphone photographs. I'm Ant Pruitt, and I appreciate y'all watching. Peace out.